Hi, my Pokey babes. It's Chanel Satisfaction here. I hope you guys are doing good. It's Saturday. We made it through another week. We're going to open up some amazing Pokemon cards. But first, I hope you guys are subscribed. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and do that now. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. If you enjoy this video by the end, if you make it midway through, it really helps my channel and my video a lot. So, today's going to be an interesting day because I'm not going to have my typical hand cam, face-to-face, -face, all the different video angles. Today is just going to be me, you, Pokemon cards on this type of video screen. Sorry, the iPad that I use, usually battery is dead and I did not charge it in time, but I need to go ahead and just open up these Pokemon cards, so we're going to do it a little different today. So bear with me, I hope you guys are still going to enjoy it regardless. It's going to be a little bit more intimate and personal. My apologies as well for no Pokemon Professor this week. Professor Priscilla will be back next week with another Pokemon, but this week she's gathering her data, she's doing more research, and she'll be with us on the next sassy saturdays but today it's just gonna be me you guys and shining legends that's right we're gonna be opening shining legends one of my favorite pokemon sets from the sun and moon era so this one's gonna be a lot of fun yeah so i wanted to go in theme with the main box of tonight is the dark rai gx so it's very dark mysterious love the purple tones and the packaging but shining legends is a smaller set i believe it's only like 80 something or something like that in the whole entire set so we should be able to complete my master set after this video if not i have a bright true ggx box that i still need to open but we should cover a lot my master set right now is close to being done but i still need a lot of cards so hopefully after today's video we'll be able to almost have my master set complete so not only are we doing the Darkrai GX box, but we're also going to do a Zoroark, the pin collection box, with the Marshadow pin collection box. These were a duo on, that's right, good old clearance sticker there. I found that at Walmart and I was like, oh really? It's only the price of one box. So somehow I was able to get two Shining Legend bo Le Legends boxes for the price of one. I'm a queen of deals, I like me a good deal, so yeah, so I had to get that. First, we're gonna get into this bad boy here. You do get four Shining Legends packs. Um, I still need all the hyper rares, I believe. I need rares, I need any GXs that are in here. I'm gonna put the most chased card after, uh, sought after in this particular set here. I can't think of it right now so I'm just going to in editing put it here on the screen for you but these are the cards that I want to get. So hopefully we get them in today's video. But I hope you guys are doing well. I've missed you guys. Um, I've been steady working trying to get caught up on a lot of other things. But mentally, I'm doing um, doing pretty good. So I hope all of you are too. Um, know that everything is going to get better, even when it doesn't feel like it. And I had to remind myself that too. Trust me, because like I am a worry wart. Wor I'm not worry wart. I can't say some words. I'm too southern. That's just how I be. I'm a mama's child. Come by it honestly. All right, so let's get this GX promo. Please recycle kids, okay? Mother Earth has had it. 2020 doesn't need any more litter. All right, you guys. So here is the Dark Rai GX. Very, very, very cool card. I love the artwork. And it's actually kind of like an alternate of the Burning Shadows Dark Ride GX. It says right here, it's the, the Burning Shadows symbol and then the big A. I mean, I think it means alternate art. So I'll look more into that after this opening, but 
very, very cool. And I apologize again for not being fully prepared and having the iPad charged. But I still hope you enjoyed this video regardless. Here is the code card for my online players. I do not use them. And here are the packs. We have a Mew, Shiny Rayquaza, Mewtwo, and another Mew. So we have two Mews. And here is the Jumbo card. Very, very cool. I have a little portfolio book um, with all my Jumbo Pokemon cards and they're actually really cool. I enjoy them. Some people are, think they're very gimmicky and they, they kind of are, but I really enjoy them. I think they're very cool. Maybe even get a couple of them framed, who knows, just to be a big dork about it. So I'm going to put that to the side. I went ahead and sleeved up the Darkrai in a Burning Shadows sleeve. Again, recycle. So I hope you guys enjoy this look. It's very dark ride inspired. I had a lot of fun painting. Um, trying to find my groove and my happy place in painting a mug again. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. So we're gonna get right into the packs. I still need many, 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 many cards. But hopefully after today, it'll be one of my first sets that are completed. And we have a green and white. You guys that are new to my channel and new to the Pokemon game, that means a good sign. It means a hollow or buff, which I think Shining Legends, you get a hollow or buff. So I'm pretty sure in every pack. Yeah, a hollow or above in every pack. So at least a hollow. So let's see. Maybe that means we'll get a GX. All right, you guys, we have a lightning energy. Spiritum, Venusaur, Ultra Ball, Purloin, Larvitar, Litten, Breloom, Golet, Great Ball. Perfect. Oh, it's a Pokemon Breeder. Very, very cool. Full art trainer support card. Wow, we are kicking this off amazingly, you guys. This is a very, very neat card. I did not have this one, and the centering on it is pretty good. Maybe a bit off from left to right, but overall, I'm, I'm already gooped. Super cool, you guys. Okay, we're starting off very, very well. Let's hope it can continue that way. So we're going to get to the Rayquaza, the Shining Legends Shiny Rayquaza pack. If you can get your hands on Shining Legends, I highly recommend doing so. It is a very, very fun set. Um, just as fun as Hidden Fates. Cards are more valuable in Hidden Fates, but this one still a lot of fun maybe we'll get a hyper rare steel energy sophocles lily pokemon breeder we just pulled her quillfish shroomish scraggy jinx reverse is a carnivine and a reshiram hollow already had her but Still cool nonetheless. So now we're gonna get into this Mewtwo pack. Focus on her. There we go. Again, I'm sorry that I don't have my hand cam, my normal setup. I totally failed. All right, third pack, you guys. Here is the code card. Good luck to the online player who gets those. Please, by all means, take them. I do not use them at all, I promise. All right, here we go, you guys. Psychic Energy, Ultra Ball, Venusaur, Lily, Litten, Totodile, Stunfisk, Ivysaur, Bulbasaur, and a Manaphy is the reverse, and a Holographic Latios. I did not have her, so 
that is very very cool the hollows are nice i will admit here is the mew the last pack for the dark cry gx box i'm excited we had a really successful box you guys here is the code card for the last pack and i'm doing four cards i hope y'all didn't see those but here you go guys bringing back that fairy energy one of my favorites um i still want to get that secret rare fairy energy i think it's in burn shadows reverse is a shroomish and a really two holographic latiases all right so the win for that box was the full art Pokemon Breeder Trainer Supporter Card. This one. Love it. Alright, you guys, so that one was a doozy. So hopefully we can win big time in this duo pack. Now again, I got this from Walmart, aka Wally World, aka Waste of Time. Um <laughs> But yeah, so let's see what's inside these boxes. Now this was for Clarence. So Shining Legends is something that's harder to come by at the moment. So if you can find them at your local card shops, at your local Walmart Target, if they randomly pop up, I suggest snatching them. Uh, I believe the Mew, Mewtwo cards in this um, are going for a decent amount. I have never um, purchased or opened a Mars Shadow pin box, so this one's going to be a new one, um, but I have opened one of these on my other channel, my Blake channel, and I believe I pulled a decent uh, pull for that one, but it's been a while, so I don't exactly remember, but head on over there, I'll leave it in the description box, and you guys can check out that channel as well. I have a lot more openings on there, but yes, yeah, so this will be my second one I've ever opened, so... Who knows? I also uh, did a Marsh Shadow Pin Collection box, or no, Figure Collection box. It is on my channel, Pop Up Here in the Eye, and you can check that out. I painted my face as Marsh Shadow too, just a little cosplay moment. And it was a lot of fun, so check that one out. I definitely believe it was a ripoff, but it was still cool to open nonetheless. All right, here's the code card for the Marsh Shadow box. Good luck to who gets that. And here are the packs. So we have a, we have two shiny Rayquaza and one shiny Genesect. The pack art on that one is okay. Um, I love all of the pack arts. I just, I love to hold them. I, I don't want to rip them open. Uh, the collector in me wants to keep something sealed, but then I'm like, I want to open it and I want to see what's in it and enjoy the cards, you know? So, without further ado, we're going to get into these. Here is the pin. Very, very cute. Um, I look forward to putting that with the rest of them. Um, I've been keeping them on my Pikachu hat. So yeah, that's where I keep all of my pens from any pen collection. Here is the uh, Mars Shadow Holographic promo. Super, super cute. Um, I love Mars Shadow. I think he's cute. Super, super cute. I love Mars Shadow. I think he's my favorite, like one of my favorite mythical Pokemon. I just love the way Mars Shadow looks. Um, I love his little green neon green when it gets in there with like a fight mode super cool yeah and i just i'm so happy to have this in my collection please recycle all right so without further ado we're going to get into these packs and i've already said that a million times but here we go so we're gonna get into a rayquaza pack one of my favorite pokemon of all time is rayquaza for sure okay here's the code card four cards here we go, you guys. Leaf Energy. Pokemon Catcher. Warp Energy. Electrode. Purloin. Larvesta. Litten. Breloom. Voltorb. Ooh, a Super Scoop Up Reverse. And a Zegrom. 
holographic. I already had her too, so it's all right. It's still a win. So we're gonna do the Genesect pet next. I believe my favorites, like the pack arts for these, would be the Rayquaza, um, the Mewtwo, the Mew, and then the Rayquaza. So here's the code card. Code card for my online players. Please, please take advantage of these. They are totally free. I do not need them, use them, want them. They're all yours, my Pokey Babe, Super Scoop Up, Spirit Tomb. Go lurk, purloin, litten. It's a kitty cat's in this one. Stunfisk. The reverse is Zorua and Hoopa. Hoopa. Did I waste my money? Probably. But you know what? I'll still be getting cards that I didn't have more than likely at least one to two per pack. So um, that's always cool. And sometimes you can get a little bit more. It depends. Now who knows if these have been repackaged as a duo. We'll never know. But sometimes that can happen with Walmart. Floatzel. Energy Retrieval. Torkoal. We have Larvesta, Minan, Minan, Freloom, Torcat. The reverse is a Torkoal and a Shaman Holographic. Yay, I already have these holographics. All right, you guys, last box so far. The best pull of the day has been that Pokemon Breeder, but can we redeem ourselves in this Zora and Collection box? The world may never know. So let me know if you guys have enjoyed my Professor Pussy Willow Pokey Minute skit I have been doing on the past couple shows. I really have a lot of fun doing her. Um, let me know if you guys are enjoying her and are wanting a lot more coming from her. And I want to, my goal is to go through as much of uh, different Pokemon as possible and give you guys some uh, info on the Pokemon and just have fun and be silly and make you guys laugh so I really hope you've been enjoying her and she will be back next week I promise. Here's the code card. Here are the packs. So we got a Mewtwo, a Mew and a Mewtwo, sorry, and another Genesect. Okay, here is the promo. The last one I had it was very poorly cut. Um, this one seems to have been cut a little bit better, so I'll probably keep this one and maybe give away um, the other promo. I want to give back and get a lot of my bulk cards and extras of cards I already have to you guys who watch and support and subscribe and share my videos, like my videos, and enjoy them. So let me know in the comment section below if you guys are ready for a giveaway. Here is the enamel pin. Very cool. Now I have two of them. Recycle. Okay, here we go. We're going to get right into this, you guys. I'm not going to waste any more of your time. I really hope for big things in this box. I have my hopes high. Here's the code card for this pack. Here we go, you guys. We are on the move. How? Do you do Great Ball, Ivysaur, is there a Bulbasaur, Stunfisk, Totodile, Litten, Curloin, Reverse Spiritomb, and a Holographic Verizion. I'm so like, I'm impressed in Amy right now, girl. I want something good and I want it now. That's what I tell my grinder hookups. I want something good and I want it now. Just kidding. Here's the code card for the Mewtwo pack. Fire energy. Here we go, you guys. Wish me all the luck. Venusaur. Arbok. Zora. Ivysaur. Torkoal. Minan. Jinx. Ooh, that's different. 
damage mover. And... Verizian again. Last pack, you guys. Keep your fingers crossed. Keep your toes crossed. Keep your eyelashes crossed. Keep everything crossed. And I hope we get last pack luck. New. I would enjoy a new hollow that I don't have. I would enjoy anything hyper rare, anything ultra rare, anything shiny. And I ruined it for myself. But I'm going to show you guys. Fairy energy, energy retrieval, uh, double colorless energy, switch, cool fish. Stunfisk, there's the cute little Bulbasaur, Golet, Voltorb, and a Reverse Shaman, and a Holographic Shaman, again. So, I want to end this on a higher note than just a Hollow. I have a Fates Collide, which I'm actually trying to get into. Um, Fates Collide, I never was into the cards again. Until Sun and Moon came out and Cosmic Eclipse and Burning Shadows, like that's when I started getting interested again. I didn't start collecting until January of this year. So I found out like there's a this is one of the only sets that has like a full art Mega Alakazam and Alakazam. The Abra line is one of my favorite uh, Pokemon lines, and it's a shame that um, it's not used as much because of licensing all that jazz. So I want to find Mega Alakazam EX or just an Alakazam Full REX, Umbreon Full REX, Glaceon Full REX. This pack or this series had pretty decent cards, so very underrated. I got this at my local, one of my local card shops, All Star Cards. So let's see if the solo pack that I got, because um, I got a bunch of other cards. I got, I got Burning Shadows. I have Burning Shadows. So, I don't think we're going to fare too well because it's a green code card, but here's the code. Don't know if you can still use XY or not. I believe it's for... I don't know. But we did get an Alec Mega Alakazam Spirit Link. That's cool. Fall School. This is a new one for me. So, I'm learning this set with you guys if you've never opened it. Uh, I love Spoink, Cute Coughing, Cottoning, Larvitar, the reverse is a Devolution Spray, and a Non-Holographic Moltres. Well you guys, I couldn't pull anything bigger than the Full Art Pokemon Breeder, but that is alright. It's still an awesome card. I am super stoked to have it in my collection now. Look at that cute little mill tank. Love it. All right, you guys. My name is Shania Satisfaction, as you all know. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Hope to see you next week for Sassy Saturdays here on my YouTube channel and now trending app and out at dot TV. And of course, Professor Pussyville will be back in full swing. She's getting her research done, like I said, and she'll be back with you guys. I hope to see you here next week. I love all of you. Stay safe, stay healthy. Please wash your hands, wear your mask, be responsible. If you aren't following me, go ahead and follow my Instagram. It is in the description box below, but I'll put it here on the screen for you as well as my Twitter. Like me on Facebook. Let's be friends. You know? If you haven't by now, go ahead and subscribe if you enjoyed today's video and give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out, helps the algorithm really um, pick it up, push it around, let people see it more as long as there's big thumbs ups going on. Please share it if you want to share it to your social medias, please feel free to do so. I would love that. Give me a little comment, give me a heart, purple heart emoji if you enjoyed today's video down in the comment section below. I'll see you guys next week and please take care of yourself. Have a great weekend. Go out and catch some Pokemon. Bye Pokebabes.